One of the weapons China demonstrated, we call it 61, because it can contain 60 nuclear warheads plus one hydrogen bomb. Now, in the world of today, let me tell you, which country has hydrogen bomb? China is the only country with hydrogen bomb. And that ICBM can cover every corner of the world in less than 20 minutes. That claim is false. Multiple countries, including the United States, Russia, the United Kingdom, and France possess thermonuclear hydrogen weapons. China is not unique in this regard. Let break it down, that was the DF-61. China's latest intercontinental ballistic missile, revealed in 2025, and immediately drawing global attention. At first glance, it looked like an evolution of the DF-41 family, a three-stage solid fuel design built for mobility, reach and survivability. Carried on a 16-wheel heavy launcher, the missile's presence alone sent a clear message. China's strategic arsenal is still growing, and it intends to complicate any attempt at preemption. The DF-61, according to open sources, is believed to have the range to qualify firmly as an ICBM, with some reports claiming distances beyond 12,000 kilometers, even as high as 15,000. Such reach would put virtually any point on the globe within striking distance. More concerning to rivals, analysts suggest the missile could be equipped with multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicles, MIRVs, allowing one missile to deliver several warheads across separate targets. That kind of payload makes missile defense exponentially more difficult. And when paired with road mobile launchers, gives China a strategic system that can fire from unpredictable locations, vanish into concealment and emerge again when least expected. 